This past week, the MOVE summer camp took place at St. John's Church. MOVE stands for Motivate, Overcome, Value, Empower. MOVE is a five-day-long summer program for girls in 6th through 12th grade. The program was started by Hopkinton's Ashley Olofsson and Alexi Phipps. So both of us are program directors and both of us are also the co-founder of MOVE. MOVE stands for Motivate, Overcome, Value, Empower, and we work with middle school and high school age girls to help them have self-confidence and empowerment, body positivity. Um, we work with issues like mental health, relationship pressures, a bunch of things that we wish that we had when we were at their age. Wait, I just want to express to you how deeply, like, you guys can control your own actions. You can choose not to gossip about people. You can choose to feel good in your body. You can choose to seek professional help for mental health needs. And I'm so proud to be here. Thank you for letting me have such an amazing week. I can't even tell you how grateful I am. And I love getting to come and sit in your squads and get to know you guys. So thank you all so much. So this is a very dynamic camp. We have a lot of guest speakers come in and give the girls lectures on important and relevant topics, as well as we play games, we do a lot of like dance parties, and we break the girls up into small groups a few times per throughout the day so they can work closely with the staff to discuss and become closer with the girls at the program. On business, you don't have to do huge things to be a leader. Somebody who is a leader is somebody who empowers themselves and the people around them. Um, so I started giving workshops when I was 15, 16 years old and the reason why I started giving workshops was because I wish that somebody was talking about issues like body image, self-esteem, mental health and since nobody was, I decided that I would and after my second workshop I met Lexi mm -hmm. um, and yeah. yeah, so basically just by luck I showed up to Ashley's workshop and I realized that all these topics were things I was really passionate about but nobody was really talking about them in school or in the media at the time so I basically just came to her and I gave her all my ideas and I was like, we need to work together. So it basically started right after that and eventually just grew into what it is today. It's been really awesome. So it's our fourth year, but it's our fifth summer program. Excellent. Mm -hmm. And uh, how did it go this week? How did everything go? It's been really amazing. Good, yeah. <laughs> I would say it's our most like successful, outstanding week ever. Yeah. Honestly, I could not be more proud. Yeah. And if somebody wanted to find out more information about the camp, is there a place they can go? They could go to moveofficial.com. That's our official website. So what were some of your favorite activities? Oh, there were so many. I always love the dance competition. I think that's one of my favorites. Then we do cross the line in the beginning of the week, which is where like you cross the line. It's supposed to show that like everyone goes through the exact same things. Oh my gosh, there's so many. I always love hearing like different like speakers come in because it gives you a different perspective on like life instead of just hearing Ashley and Lexi, which are great. I love them, but it's just good for a variety. Mm -hmm. So you enjoyed the camp overall? Yes, this is my fourth camp doing it. They did two summer programs last summer, so I did both of those, and then I did one two years ago, and then now this is my fourth, and I could not be any happier. I'm sad that I can't be a camper anymore, but I'm also excited that I can be part of the staff next year, which I've been looking forward to since I came, which is great. Would you recommend it to others? others? Oh, I would recommend this camp to like anyone. I've had so much fun. I've like laughed so hard. Anyone who really wants to get like positivity and like fun in their life, like come here. It's so worth it. I like really haven't gotten like much sleep because I'm just like so excited to come. I'm like, no! And then towards the end of the week, I was like 6.30, but I'm like, it's completely like worth waking up so much earlier to come set up at the camp and then watching them make a fool of themselves in the morning and then like helping them like pack up and everything.